so hi everyone today we will be demonstrating the newest model by openai that is gpt4 o mini so it is a miniature version of gpt4 o which is more cost efficient and even faster so talking about the cost it is 60% cheaper than gpt 3.5 turbo so that's the best part the context window 128k looks fine to me and the knowledge base has been updated to october 2023 so previously for 3.5 it was january 2022 talking about the performance gpt4 o mini as claimed by openai has outperformed gpt 3.5 turbo and smaller models on various benchmark it is not able to beat out gpt4 o but it does make sense because it is a bigger model it's a, the better model now the best part about gpt4 o mini is that it is available for all by default so if you remember in your chat ui earlier it was GPT 3.5 Turbo. Now it would be replaced by GPT 4.0 O Mini. So let's test it out. Even you can try it out in your Chat GPT UI. So I will be testing it out on a few use cases. Starting with a small Hey. So here you can see that how I can switch to GPT 4.0 O Mini. You can just choose GPT 4.0 O Mini uh, and replace GPT 4.0 O Mini. Yeah. Now let me ask it a few complicated questions. First, let's start off with writing a story. Write a story on a small kid in village. So by default, it will first go to GPT-4 uh, Omni, the bigger model. Just look at the speed also. So here you can see that the inferencing is decent for GPT-4 Omni, the major model, right? It is writing me a decent story in a quant village nestled between rolling green hills lived a small boy named Arjun. Something like this. I, if I can like quickly eyeball the story looks fine to me. Yes. Now let's see the magic. GPT-4 o mini. Just see the speed. Yeah, it's blazing fast. Apart from that, I think the storyline is also almost the same as you can see. Some words are changing here and there, but yeah, this entire story has been written now. So I think in terms of inferencing, GPT-4 O mini is even beating GPT-4 O, not just GPT-3.5 and the quality also looks fine to me. Next, let me try it out on a mathematical problem. What is 2.4 into 3.5? Now, as you can see, it is again using by default GPT-4 Omni. When I change it, you can see the speed. The results are same for both. So on most of the cases, if you are going for a general task, I think GPT-4 Omni would be a great tool and would be almost equivalent to GPT-4 Omni if you are not doing a very complicated task. Let me ask it to write a code as well. Write a Python code for training a classification model classification model on titanic data set so why i'm doing this comparison for between gpt4 o and gpt4 o mini to just show you the difference between the inferencing power so this is again by default going to gpt4 o because my quota hasn't been exist uh, exhausted but this is helping us to understand the difference between the two models even the better model in terms of inferencing is getting beaten up by the newer model, which is free for everyone. So I think that's the best part. Here you can see that the code almost looks say, uh, correct to me. Now, if I change switch back to GPT-4 O mini, GPT-4 O mini is free for everyone. So do remember this. Now just see the speed. I think the quality of the content also look right to me almost similar and the answer has been completed so i think it's just amazing to me that such powerful tools are getting uh, free of cost to everyone uh, now testing it out on the last topic Ex explain me the fourier transform so this is something that i never understood let's see whether i am able to understand using gpt4 o or gpt4 o mini now here you can see that GPT-4 O has hung a bit, which happens quite usual to me also. So that is why I started liking GPT-4 O mini quite a lot since I'm using it since morning because it's not stucking at all. It's very smooth 
and the results are almost same so even if you read the story the story plot was also similar from both the models so i'm assuming they have been using some techniques which have taken some sort of a knowledge distillation sort of a training from omni if i change this model again the inferencing would be faster and if you remember the headings are almost the same so the results are also not changing that much for everyone so i think that gpt4 o mini is a real game changer and being it free for everyone makes it really special do try it out do work it out on your different use cases and let us know in the comments how you feel about it thank you